Hello everyone. How are you? Hope you all are doing well. So, today we will learn our second chapter of class 5th geography and our chapter's name is latitude and longitude. Okay, so let's start. Yes, but before getting into our today's topic, I would like to request all the friends to recall some basics of our previous lecture to recall what some basics okay so uh, what basics okay what are the basics so do you remember no problem if you don't remember i'll tell you see actually we must uh, we must understand the chapter globe and maps if we will not understand the chapter globe and maps we cannot understand this class properly okay we cannot understand this class properly okay so let's start so uh, see but uh, there is one thing that uh, if you uh, if you have not uh, watched my video my lecture my previous lecture about globe and maps so you can watch my previous lecture about globe and maps okay you can you can watch my previous lecture you can watch what my previous lecture okay so let's start so our today's topic is what our today's topic is what our today's topic is latitude latitude and longitude what is latitude and longitude okay so okay so let's start see so we know about directions what are directions so uh, i'm going to tell you see uh, this is a globe okay this is a globe so a globe has some directions what are these directions see first is west east south north okay so do you know what are the directions between all these directions so let me tell you see the direction between north and west is northwest the direction between north and east is northeast the direction between south and west is southwest and the direction between south and east is southeast got it okay okay so let's move on so uh, so now let's understand about equator what is equator do you know what is equator no problem it's very simple equator is an imaginary line which is running on the globe which is running on the globe got it okay so it divides the earth means the equator divides the earth into two equal half what is the work of equator it divides the earth into two equal half got it okay so see uh, so the northern half is known as northern hemisphere and the southern part is known as southern hemisphere what is northern part northern hemisphere southern part southern hemisphere understood okay so for better understanding let's see an image of equator and hemisphere so see see this is a world map of this is a world map of earth okay so you can see a red line over here so what is this red line this red line is equator and this equator is dividing the earth into two equal half understood okay so now let's see the uh, and, and let's see the equator in a globe in a globe image okay so see there is a line over here you can see so this line is what this line is equator equator divides the earth into two half okay the first part is northern hemisphere second is southern hemisphere okay so see this is an axis over here so the axis Uh, uh, the axis comes from northern pole to southern pole it's horizontal sorry it's what it's what it's uh, it's vertical okay and do you know that the earth rotates on its axis 
got it so see now uh, what uh, what is axis of the earth so uh, let's understand uh, the axis by its definition so see see an axis is an imaginary line on which the earth rotates okay so what is the axis axis is an imaginary line on which the earth rotates got it okay okay i hope you have got it all about equator and hemisphere okay so let's move on to our another topic so now we'll understand about latitude by its simple definition we'll understand about what latitude by its what simple definition so see uh, see if you don't know the definition of latitude no problem i'll tell you but yes there is a condition you have to like share and subscribe my video then only i'll tell you pakka you will okay okay so i'm going to answer it see latitude what is latitude so latitude are all the parallel lines of a equator let me show you an image see this is what this is an image so all the parallel lines this is this is a equator over here so this is a equator and all the other parallel lines are what these are latitude understood these are what latitude okay so second is these are also called imaginary lines okay so these are also called what imaginary lines and yes if anyone will say to you that come 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 there is a latitude behind my house so just do not believe on him or she whatever because it's an imaginary line you cannot see it so just they he or she will be making fun of you okay he'll be making fool he'll he, you will be become you will become a fool by him so just forget it okay so see third is you must know these lines are you must know that these lines are horizontal because it comes from west to east okay so it comes from where west to east so just see now the uh, see, you can see west to east these lines are horizontal also it is coming from west to east also okay so see third is see third point is these lines are running from west to east we know oh, got it okay so oof, the, 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 you have understood understood that so friends you know that you know that there are some important and special latitudes there are some important and special latitudes yes you heard right so what are these special latitudes these special latitudes are tropic of cancer and top tropic of capricorn these are what tropic of cancer and tropic of capricorn okay so what is the Uh, what is the importance of latitude and why we are learning about latitude okay so we learn all these topics in in detail in my next video okay so if you are liking my videos please 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 like share and subscribe my video bye bye